the stuff I hear from this chair <laughs> in commercial breaks and prior to the show, you would not believe. I am honored that we're Emmy nominated for what you do consume and you do hear. I proffer to say the competition would be over with all due respect to every single one of the other Emmy nominated daily shows up for the trophy next week. If you got what you hear, what I hear off air, competition would be over. We'd already have a trophy in the case or right next to me right here to wit. I've been hearing the conversation between you guys for weeks now, and I'm like, when's the perfect time to bring it up? Today's now the time to pop it out of the bag. (laughs) Mike Del Tufo, you say that back in your day, when I was a really in Livingston, New Jersey, right? Good six pack abs runner. Okay. You were a runner. I was the epitome. I finished number one on the police test in the physical test. Okay. And you had to run in that and do 40s and stuff. Just just like. I'm setting this Just up. Just like George Stone, aka Giuseppe from the uh, from the Untouchables. Yes. You were you were you were the best in your class. I was the best in my class. Okay. Yes. I, I, so, I, I um, Garcia okay. Reference. So um, you claim what now? What I claimed. We had a talk, and Chris will set it up because he'll you know have that to set it. I think I've set it up. Down. We uh, talked about Lawrence Taylor. I don't know why it came up. We were just talking about TJ, and I, yeah, and I yeah, went, yeah. and I don't know why it came up, and I'm like. Something I don't know why somebody talked about speed. I'm like, he wouldn't have caught me when I was like a kid because he's one of the fastest around the edge ever. There's no question. To which I agree. Reggie White, those guys, Deacon Jones. I might have been Deacon Jones might have caught me. He's a little smart, but still, at the same time, smarter than who? There's no way I would have totally beaten him off the line. There's no way I was 100. You would have beaten pounds. Lawrence Taylor off he the line. Have caught me. I, I'm telling you, no one could catch me when I was a kid. Oh, no boy. one. No one. My brother Anthony, I would play with him and go, come on at me, and I'd run away from him. And he was in good, he was a lacrosse, all-state lacrosse player. My brother Frank couldn't catch me. I want my brother Frank to call. He'll tell you. I was one of the fastest kids around. That's all I could do was run mm-hmm. and, and roller skate. Well, both um, one of the best roller skaters and one of the best runners I know ever, period. We would have, I'd have people try to catch me all the time. He would not have caught me. Lawrence Taylor. Not in his day, in his sprinter, Lawrence Taylor, in his rookie of the year day in New Jersey, the two of you were probably that's probably around the time where you were you were as good as now, you're saying rookie of the year. So you're saying right out of college, like he's right, coming we're in. saying you're no, yeah, Lawrence is. Taylor at his peak, Mike Del Tufo at his peak. Del Tufo has a faster burst than Lawrence Taylor, hundred percent. Now, do you have like a head start, or are you just yeah? You got to give me like I said, he couldn't catch me. To take that term, I'm not saying I would beat him in a race. He wouldn't have caught me. I would have gotten away from him. He wouldn't have tracked you down. He wouldn't have tracked me down. Like he did every single like quarterback. Panther, but the quarterbacks like a, like a, were... were, were like, uh, Stationary. Right? Stationary. Yeah. yeah. It's, you can't, I'm not saying I'm, I'm faster than him that way. I'm faster getting away from him. He would, And that is exactly what I said, Chris. You know I'm right. I, I said he wouldn't I, catch I, me. I, I believe you that's what you said. But the fact that you actually believe this, he oh, doesn't I totally believe it. Do. He doesn't believe it. I do Chris. believe it. Nah. Remember the actor Michael Vartan, who he's been here before? I think he once upon a time said that he could have tackled Jerome Bettis from the 10 yard line coming in. See, that's like crazy. at least one time out of 10, he would have been able to take out Jerome Bettis. That's crazy. But you're not. Okay, so wait, wait you're at a starting line. Ready, Mike? Go. 1,001, 1,002, and then catch Lawrence me. goes, no. you're not getting not, caught? Yeah, no, I'm getting away from him. 100%. Because he's only got like five, or the, the, he's a bigger guy. He's only got like five, maybe ten seconds of speed. Mm-hmm. Then he's done. I'm gone. I'm already gone. Where are you going? I'm going to keep <laughs> running and he ain't going to catch me. <laughs> it's not the destination, and, Chris. It's oh, not the destination. The way, when I was in my peak form, when I ran the New York City Marathon, what year was I that? that? I told you, eighty-three, eighty-two. It was I twice. I did it. Getting back to my point, that was when I was at my peak form of running. Yes, and I was literally, and I say this, no one was faster than me, except for a couple kids on my team that was that were on my lacrosse. I mean, on my what do you call it? My uh, track team. Track team. Uh-huh. My, my brother Anthony, who was in phenomenal shape at that point, still couldn't catch him. I don't know how we can confirm this. How do we confirm There's no way to do it. There's no way to do it. It doesn't exist. All right, now hold on a second. If you were so good, right? Yeah. Let's just, let's just 
trust everything that you're saying. Okay, which is, oh If my you're God. so good, why aren't you coaching Rich to run the 40? Because I was not, I, I don't consider myself a sprint He's type. not a speed guy. No, I was, I was yeah. He's, but, a, he's, a, but, he's, not a spr- he's not a speed guy, he's an escape guy. I'm an escape guy, that's exactly he's escape it. Guy. He's the Houdini. I was the baby the Hood- in the family. He's I had to get Hood- away from everybody as a kid getting beat you're up. You're not a speed guy, but you're going to get away from LT? The, Ho- the no, Houdini no, 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 of no, no, Essex no. County. Oh, right your there. brother called in. All right, Frank Del Tufo, uh, Mike Del Tufo, who I believe you know uh, intimately yeah. in a long time. Mike claims the following, <laughs> that back in his running days, his track days, where he had a six-pack and he was really a fast guy, that he had enough speed that given a slight head start, Lawrence Taylor himself did not run him down. Frank, your thoughts? Uh, I'm trying to think, Rich, to be completely honest. Um, I, I hate to say it. I don't. I really don't remember that. <laughs> no, no, no. He's thinking you said I raced Lawrence Taylor. That's what he's thinking right. you said. Oh, no, no. no. Was he I, said. Yes. He said. That's exactly what I thought. That he was yeah. so fast as a kid that if he raced Lawrence Taylor and got a few feet head start, Lawrence Taylor would not have been able to catch him. He was that fast. Yay or nay? Not even after a night of Mexican food, Rich. No chance. He's a thief. Are you serious, Frank? I, 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 Mike was fast, but, I mean, LT was pretty fast, too. So he's so taking I, your side. I would have to. I would have to say that if yeah. they were in the forest or yes. the Howard Desert somewhere, that, yes. that Lawrence was going to be eating a good meal after he caught Mike. <laughs> <laughs> like the Serengeti, like one of those, yeah. one of those, yeah. one of those Wild Kingdom shows where he watched, yeah. uh, where, where, where he watched Marlon Darwinism Perkins. at work. <laughs> Is what you're like saying? The, like on the safari ride in. in uh, Disney World. Mike would have been dead. Lawrence Taylor and <laughs> Ray Perkins, not Marlon Perkins. But okay, yeah. very good, sir. Mike is you're very disappointed in your brother right well, now. Well, because he didn't answer. I mean, you you asked him the wrong thing what first. Do you mean? It was like yeah. excuse me. No, 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 no. Excuse me. He what? didn't run cross country with Wait, me. Frank, Frank never ran with me. But, Frank, but you offered him up as the uh, testimonial. He just he's giving you proof that I ran and I was. He actually said I was fast. That's not the. No, no, no. You guys still have not won this court case. Wait, wait, time out. What did Lawrence Taylor run the 40 in? That's Does what we need to find out. Any? About 4 6. I looked it up. Yeah. Mike, I, Mike, Mike, we could have used the sundial for you, pal. Oh, he's a liar. <laughs> he's such a liar. He's such a liar. <laughs> my brother Frank. See, this is why I hate <laughs> my brother. My brother Frank. Frank, Frank Del Tufo. Oh, what happened to your mic? Rich. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, Rich's Uh-oh. mic went out. I'm back. Oh, I'm I back. Hear you. Oh, Say hi to your brother for me. Frank, thank you for the call. Job, Appreciate Frank. it. Hey, see you next week, time. Frank. Hey, see you next week, hopefully. Have a great flight. Take the, care, guys. The, the Bye-bye. great Bye-bye. Frank Del Tufo confirming what we all oh, believe. Please. That, he didn't confirm anything. That you're fast. You yeah, would have been fast, but Lawrence Taylor fast. Get out of here. He's Frank and Chris Brockman could be twin brothers. But they're not. They'll never admit anything. Yeah, they could be. But he's your brother. Yeah, sad. Like the Bengals, you just need to tweak the story a little bit. Yeah, just fine-tune it. You don't need an overhaul because you're fast. Anyway. Just tweak it. That Lawrence Taylor would have tracked you down. Nope. Here's what confuses me. <laughs> like, here's what nope. confuses me. Brockman, you can attest to this. We always hear Del Tufo's story, and I know this because he's put it on Twitter a hundred times. As a kid, he wasn't athletic. He didn't play, so he liked to sit there and record the guys playing, and he started to mix, right? Now, all of a sudden, you're an athlete, no, 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 and no, no, you no, ran no, no, track. No, no. But, I have never that said was I'm ne- an athlete. I am as far from being at my scholastic abilities are that of the worst person you've ever seen play a sport. Yeah, and you said no, that multiple now, times, and now you I expect do, me can, there's to believe that Lawrence Taylor the- that I could do very well, run and roller skate. And I can, I will have a billion witnesses tell you I, I was the best roller skater in my rink, like literally, when I was a kid. Did they give out trophies for that? Yeah, or? I okay. used to win races and be put All a half right. lap. My brother Frank was the same. He actually used to get put back because he skated with me. We'd be put back a half a lap behind people and still beat them in the All races. All skate, guys. All skate. All skate. Oh, oh, what, was, what was the uh, what was the uh, the top forty disco song at the time? When you were doing oh, that. back then, I mean, like, like what, like what, what disco skating? song? What disco song got you skating the fastest? 
Disco Duck by Rick Dees. Oh, so many, so many songs. I got too Rick many. Dees Rick Dees nuts. <laughs> <laughs> so many songs. Which there was song so when it came on? You're like, I am gonna skate like the well, wind. Well, we didn't skate fast. All the music back then was kind of slow, like you oh, know, R and B music. I mean, come on, I got. This entire venture and conversation, it's just one small gear away from being just the best gear possible. We've just missed that gear, whether it was, whether it was nah, Frank. You didn't miss the gear. You nah. busted my chops. And I, I, at the end of the day, my brother didn't really corroborate my story. He did say I was fast. There is, he actually said the line. Somewhat corroboration. But, but that was But fast. Christopher in front of a jury. The no. jury the jury convicts within no, five minutes, right? Of my peers. A, a jury convicts no, within five right. minutes. Convicts. Convicts one. Uh, is the story to be false? No, yeah, probably. No, no, no. They, the, no. the jury does not find for the no. uh, for the defendant. I don't believe so. All it takes is one, though, Rich. Yeah, well, it, I could I could get one. All it takes is one. Mike I'm, Del Tufo <laughs> is presumed slow until proven fast. <laughs> In this well, court of law, well, we're helping, convicted. Mike, you'd have to really like. There'd be we, no we, way to prove this. But we'd have Presumed to run down your, we'd have to run down your fast. track code. Yeah, you're no way to prove it. <laughs> we'd have to run Mr. down Mielko some former probably teammates. probably still alive. <laughs> he <laughs> probably still coaches the track team at Seton Hall Prep. The problem <laughs> is, is that we could get LT on the phone. Oh, yeah, and I'll be the LT's gonna put. I mean, it's a place like Lawrence right Taylor, who's, yeah, who's ne never right heard right of, right. never heard yeah. of Mike Dutufo is gonna, gonna be LT's club. <laughs> I DJed at LT's club. I you just like gave a point. So, like, there you go. Hold on, last There's thing. Last thing. Separation. LT, rem you're, you're claiming no, LT remembers LT you. LT will never remember. Okay, very good. All right. Not a chance. All right. I will not. I will not very even good. go there. This is. I know fun. now. From now on, the way I got to do this, I got to stop. Tell the truth. Before I, no. Oh. I got to stop. No, because I always do. I've proven you guys wrong enough. Uh, but at the end of the day, I got to stop yes. and then reevaluate how I. My problem is I say something too fast. Well, your mind moves. And my mind moves faster than yeah. my mouth. Yes. And what happens is when my mouth gets in, I'm, I'm sorry, my mouth moves faster than my I mind. I was about to say, your mouth moves and very fast. And what happens fast. is Pause. when I He's do got that, trouble with speed. <laughs> it sounds like I'm embellishing or lying. And it's I'm actually not. And a lot of my friends will tell you that that's one of my biggest problems. Even when I'm like explaining something to somebody, if I just went and paused, I'd be way better. Dude. We love you. We know I exactly know. who you That's are. What I am. We know exactly what you mean. We know exactly what I you're about. <laughs> Let's take a break. When we come back, Tiger Woods has. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.